Hey guys, it's me Alexis Rebrands here coming at you with another video and today as you can tell by my setup I am doing a, another Paint or actually my first real painting video for you guys um, Most of this video will be time-lapse, but I have my phone here for a second point of view um, To show you guys my color mixing and I also have this point of view to show you guys me painting the doll so I'm doing the custom Tibby kit. This is a custom doll. I won't tell you who it is because she wants to keep it a surprise. Um, but I am doing a custom Tibby kit. Um, she's going to be a Caucasian baby. She has greenish color eyes. And she's going to be having blonde hair. Um, also, so yeah, that is what I'm going to be doing today. So if you want to continue to watch me paint. I filmed it but I did go on Instagram live when I painted it I remember um so she has her like a uh, really light 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 flesh color on I just use some baby skin which is this is a baby skin actually as you this is what she looks like so yeah, that's what I use is this and I have most of my colors here um, so you can get the little 8 kit, I don't think this is all of them, this is not, this is only 6 out of the 8, uh, but this is what I use for my Caucasian babies, I might use the other ones later. But basically what I have, I'm not using the brown brown today. And another one, I don't know which one it was. Uh, but I use this nail tip. I used to use white, but this nail tip is like an off-white, which looks a lot better for the nails. And I'm starting to do like the little half crown that you have on here. I found it looks like a lot realistic. Um... So yeah, I'm learning. Um, I also used a little bit of flesh eight with flesh seven. I just got all the. Ooh, I dropped my paint. I just got. It. I also let me move you a little closer. But I also um, get all the flesh cones. I got the lighter flesh cones that I usually use, which is this 07, 08, and the baby skin. I tested all these colors and she likes some mixed a little bit um that I show her so that's what we're going to do um I also uh, yeah this is a matte varnish that comes with the kit um I use the eyelid purple I don't know if I'm gonna use this just yet um the lip and blush which I use but try to wonder how I use that much because I don't like my dolls that blushed. Especially my bigger dolls. And then this is the vein blue. So I really like the vein blue. It's really pigmented. I haven't used that much. You see it's like barely touched. Like I really haven't used that much. A little goes a long way. And this is the nail tip. And blue, and I also use a yellow, just a Genesis yellow, which I've used a lot of because I've done a lot of Caucasian babies and mixed babies, and I always mix a dabble, really small. I'm dropping stuff like I'm just miss a little dabble of Genesis yellow. So yeah, that is that. So, this is the TV kit I'm working with. Her head is huge. Like, it doesn't even fit in the camera frame. Laid on the side. Her head is huge compared to my hand. 
Her head is huge. It's like two handfuls of head. So I don't paint the head. I paint all the way up into the hairline, which my hairline is going to be up here. Because um, she's going to have bangs, so it's kind of my hairline is going around here. Um, so yeah, I paint up here. I don't paint the top of the head um, because you're not going to see it because it's going to have hair covered. If I was to do painted hair, I would paint it a little bit, but not really. You don't really have to focus on the top of the head unless it's a bald baby. Um, so yeah, this is just that. I don't know if I'm going to do eyelashes on her. I don't know. All I have is black ones, so... I don't know if I'm going to be able to do eyelashes on her, um, but I don't know. I don't even know if she wants eyelashes, so I'll have to, I will have to ask, um, but I usually don't do eyelashes on my babies, but I haven't did a big baby like this, but mm -hmm. she's cute without eyelashes, she's cute, she'd probably look cute with eyelashes, I just haven't, haven't did any eyelashes. She's going to have eyebrows. Um, duh. So, yeah. So, I'm going to go ahead and mix. Oh my god, her head is so heavy. It flops. Anyways, this is what I use. People say don't use this. I only saw one person that said don't use the plastic. But I haven't had any trouble with plastic. So, if you hear they say don't use the plastic, it ruins the Genesis paint. I haven't had any problem using the little plastic trays you see no problem um so i don't know why you wouldn't be able to use plastic i mean these do come with you know, glass things like glass but i don't know i don't know i use the plastic jars and i keep my paints in them so i don't mean i don't know i'll have to look it up but yeah i don't know so I'm going to take a little of the baby skin and the Flesh 07 mixed with a little bit of Flesh 08. I'm running out of Flesh 08. As you see, I use a lot of it. Um, and this is just going to be my second layer. Um, my next layer, I will mix a little bit of yellow. Actually, I might even mix a little bit of yellow. I don't know. I just eyeballed it. Um, here are my brushes up here. I don't grab to that many brushes, so I mean, you don't need this many brushes. I really, um, for my bigger babies, to distribute the paint, I grab to this brush. Uh, and mainly my sponges, which I just noticed I don't have with me. So I'm going to go get my sponges and show you my rest of my brush. Okay, so I almost forgot to show you. Oh, I knocked over my head. my pink thing there i just put in this little squirty bottle because it's easier for me to put it in a little container um but it comes in this this is the mona lisa paint thinner odalis paint thinner i have a speed speed ball this is what i use this one i because i saw jackie them use it and just a lot of people use it so I decided that I would use it too. So this is what it is. It's on Amazon. I'll link it down below. Um, but I think I showed you in this video on my my last couple videos ago. Um, everything you need. So I believe I showed you guys the odorless paint thinner. So I mean. I'm gonna be mixing my paint in my little paint palette. So, 07, and this is all I use. And um, what I'm gonna do is I take a little bit of. Everybody has their favorite little brush, and this is mine. As you can see, it's very worn out, but it still works for paint. But yeah, it's very worn out. I'm gonna take some of my paint thinner. 
just to clean my brush out. It's good to start getting a wet, clean brush. And yeah, my brush is mostly clean. It had a little red on it. mostly clean <laughs> so I'm taking my 07 and I'm going to put some over this paint thinner this one is going to be for me to clean my brush and it's going to be for my actual paint take a little bit of that which is one brush I consider one side of a brush two brushes is two sides um, a half a brush, whatever you want to consider it. So I take a little bit of that, which is a nice color, but you want to get some like pigment in there. So I'm going to take just a teensy bit, like a little bit of 08, like a really tiny bit, like half of a half of a brush. Let me show you. So like half of a half of a brush. And I'll just put it in there. Mix it. And this is my color. You wring it out. That's what I do. Put all my color in. And I'm going to take a little bit of this. You don't need too much of this. Maybe your paints are probably new to mine. My paints are still new, but not as new. And like a half a brush, give or take, of this. I don't really, um, I don't really measure, so I just eyeball it whatever color just close up your paints um. okay. and we're going to take our genesis with yellow and I kid you not we're going to put the littlest littlest to it, it's like a little dibble dabble on your brush. Let me show you guys so you can see. Literally, a little dibble dabble. This is probably too much <laughs> um, in your paint just to give it a little color. Just a little color, and if it's too much, you can always add other colors and just wipe your excess off. Dipping your little paint thinner and clean your brush off. This is my color. It's a little too yellow for me personally. Um, but if you like this color, you like this color. Um, but I'm going to put some more. Um, one of these colors. Mm, maybe 08. I'm gonna put a little bit more of 08 in this. But this is a nice color, but it's a little too yellow tone. I'll tell you, this yellow is very pigmented. My first baby is a little too um, orange. I mean, yellow for me, anyways. Um. I just put a little bit in there to tone it down. Okay. So here is my color. I don't know if you guys can see this, but I'm on the second angle. Here's my color. I just put in some more of uh, a little bit of a flesh 08 in there. You're done with the yellow. I mean, the yellow is really good to, you know, 
and brighten the color up a little bit. And give it some. Mm, one of these colors. Mm, maybe 08. I'm going to put a little bit more of 08 in this. But this is a nice color, but it's a little too yellow tone. Okay, this yellow is very pigmented. So, here is my color. I don't know if you guys can see it, so I'm going to set it angle. Here's my color. I just put in some more of a little bit of a flesh of eight in there. You're done with the yellow. I mean, the yellow is really good to, you know, brighten the color up a little bit and give it some pigment. But this is a nice color. Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to use this angle, which is like dark. Um. But this is a doll. So far, I'm gonna put the flash on in just a second. But this is her with her first layer of skin done. It's really dark in here, but my first layer of skin done. And this is it with the flash. You can kind of see the paint a little bit that I need to blend out a lot more with the foil on. So that's what I use. Um, you can really see it. So I'm going to blend it a lot more, but I just wanted to show you. Mora, but I think I did an okay job. Let me know how you like it. Um, it was some challenges in here, that's why it took me so long to upload. But here's the video for you guys. Thank you guys for watching. I love you all so much. Peace and bye.